Doctor, do you have anything else uh, to add? Uh, the information I provided for you is just the tip of the iceberg. I mean, there's so much more evidence that clearly shows that boxing not only causes great physical damage, but neurological damage as well. So you think boxing should be outlawed? Huh, yes, I do. Well, thank you very much, Doctor. <clears throat> All right, send in the next expert witness, please. <laughs> Good to be back in Caesar's Palace. Uh, I feel that the fight will go at least seven rounds. But you know, he had yeah, he had me running back on my heels. Sir, can you state your name, please? Oh, oh, straight up, straight up. Uh, call the tooth, Williams. Call the tooth to set you free. That's what I'm saying. Uh, Mr. Williams, uh, you fought some of the world's greatest fighters, uh, George right. Foreman, Muhammad Ali, right. and so on. Uh, what would you say they all have in common? Uh, they all kick my ass. <laughs> Basically, that's, that's what it happened. You know, they, they all uh, had kicked my ass. But you know, that ain't the thing, no. Because I want me some, I want me some Tyson. That's what I want, understand? You know, but he's trying to hide from me. But I'm going to find him, you know, because uh, I want some Tyson. Uh, Mr. Williams, <clears throat> regarding your health, yeah. uh, do you feel that boxing uh, has in any way uh, affected your sex life? Well, she ain't with me no more, but... I don't think that really has anything to do with, you know, my boxing. You know, I don't know who told you about all that, but, you know, uh, it ain't like I can't still, you know, swing when I get inside the bed, you know. Mr. Williams, wouldn't you agree that boxers who have taken as many blows to their head as, as you have, uh, shall we say, lost something upstairs? Uh, basically. <laughs> Basically, they have, and uh, but you know, it's nothing to do with boxing. See, what it is, it's a ploy and a plan for this Senate and everybody here to try to keep me away from Tyson, and I got to have some Tyson. I mean, according to our file, you've sustained multiple injuries to your your jaw, your head. Yeah, yeah, you look like that fellow on Star Trek. <laughs> Don't he? Straight up, cuz, he looks just like him, but anyway, I take... I take exemptions to that because, you know, e even in the ring, you know, I keep my tooth polished, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Just in case, like, I'm selling these $5.99 out at the crib and stuff. Y'all want to come by and get you so you can. Uh, Mr. Williams? Yeah. Mr. Williams, <clears throat> over your career, how many blows to the head would you say you have taken? <laughs> I took all of them to the head. But, I mean, that's the best way to take it. Take it to the head, you know what I'm saying? Come on down here and let me show you what I'm talking about. Uh, just let him do it. Come on. <laughs> man, man, what you want to do? Chris? Come at me now. Come on with your best shot. Come on, what you want me? Oh, come on, with your best shot. Come on. <laughs> uh, he caught me with one. It was a rabbit punch. I think, you know, don't stop the fight, though. Don't stop the fight. Don't stop it, man. I can go on. Don't stop it, man. I don't stop the fight. Uh, Y'all want a Coke or Sprite or something? Because it's a two-drink minimum if you're sitting in these tents. Mr. Will. I got to see some ID from y'all. I don't think you're helping your cause by demonstrating this kind of... Oh, you trying to you trying to dog me? You you trying to dog me? Mr. Williams. Well, come on, Marsha Brady, come on. What you want to... Ah! <laughs> well, basically, the reason that I didn't hit is because I respect women. And, uh, you know, the whole... Boxing got my head dizzy, and she called me off guard. Miss Williams, you, you claim that boxing's been very good to you. Yeah, but in a I... sense, in a sense. Uh -huh. well, but, but I hardly think that your report, let alone your record, supports your claim. Oh, yeah, I do have a record out. It's called uh, Call the Tooth in the House, and it's like, mm, got the cake on icing, gonna give me some type to Your testimony's been very helpful and very enlightening. Thank you for your time, and you'll get our decision later. No, it ain't gonna be no decision. No, I got the hair of mine. That's, the, that's how they took my last fight from me. It ain't gonna be no decision. What you talking about decision? You see, you all sitting over there all bourgeois uh, and stuff. Charlie, no, that's what please. it is. That's a little bourgeois. Hey, man, you better get up off me, man. Get up my, get up my, my head is this. <laughs>